Look what HEW found when it made a special investigation into the spending of the vast funds it administers. We just uh, got the plan from the Public Health Service on reducing the necessary beds. In these reels of tape that record every payment made, every recipient, they found evidence that a staggering seven and a half billion dollars had been lost by fraud, waste, and abuse in one year. Doctors, building contractors, hospitals, schools, welfare recipients, everyone had been fraudulently dipping into the pot. And the investigation isn't over yet. The inevitable consequence of having a huge pot of taxpayers' money is that all of us want to get our hands in it. You can be sure that we'll all be able to find very good reasons why we should be the ones to spend somebody else's money. Somebody or other put up a good case for spending taxpayers' money to subsidize rents in New York City, including the rents of these apartments. The people who occupy these apartments pay something like $200 a month less than the market rent. And that subsidy comes out of the taxes of people, most of whom are much poorer than the people who live here. It's not unusual for this sort of thing to happen when government tries to do good with our money.